Hi, you there, mysterious stranger. Yoo-hoo. Yeah, you. There any other mysterious stranger around here? You know what? Who, me? How about I tell you a joke? Sure, be my guest. What must all trauma team medics swear to uphold? The hypocritical oath! <laughs> okay, uh, what's going on? Hey there, stranger! I'm Brendan, your friendly neighborhood SCSM, and the nicest AI in all of Night City. You can select from a wide range of beverages, or just drop by for a chat anytime. Now it's your turn. What's your name? Why am I talking to a schism? <laughs> My name is V. Pleasure to meet you, V. Do you come here often? Uh, pretty often, as a matter of fact. I'm sorry. Did I correctly hear you ask if I wanted to join you for a cup of coffee? Um, no. Oh, well, that's okay. Because you can have one now. And just to clarify, we don't have to move an inch. How do you take it? Milk? Sugar? Okay, you got me. I'm sold. Sold? Nothing's gonna be sold here. Cause you know what? I'm gonna give you a can of Night Cola for free. That's My man. Brennan, right? <laughs> That's right. Gosh, it's so cool you remembered. Even for a simple SCSM. Cool. So, did you want something from me? Oh, yes. Well, I do apologize for taking advantage of you at this early stage in our friendship. But, could I ask you for a favor? What happened? I would do anything for you, Brendan. See that container in front of me? It's completely blocking my view of the street. Depriving an SCSM of its greatest pastime. Could you move it a bit to the side? I'll reward you with my undying gratitude. Even though, technically, I don't stock that. I'll see what I can do. Brendan, I would literally kill for you. Oh, I'm strong enough. Let's go. Thank you, V. Boy, are you strong. Here, have a refreshing beverage on me. My man. Catch you later, Brendan. Catch me? Why? Will I be falling? It's just something you say as a way of goodbye. Oh, I get it. I mean, I don't, because catching has nothing to do with goodbyes, but... <laughs> oh, well. Don't humans say the darndest things? Catch you later, V. <laughs> what a neat phrase. Cybernetic Ninja Killer. The way I see it, only thing waiting for you here is getting off or getting off. Place your bets. What if I miss this time? Enlighten me. Brain dance chick is hiding something. No coincidence we already saw two tiger claws. They must control the building. In response to increased gang activity, our sock and the tiger claws are in bed together. Go figure. Every corp plays dirty, except the streets are more than that. They're filth. So the corps leave it to the gang. Suits collars and gets soiled. Surprised? Nope. No, I mean, if Evelyn wanted to disappear, especially from Arasaka, she could have done better. This whole situation's bent over, cheeks spread wide. Kang Tao recently expressed. But Judy's lying. Why? Little something called intuition, V. Ever heard of it? Oh, so what you meant to say was you're full of shit. Got it. That Johnny. So hold on. Welcome to Clouds, where we know what you're looking for. Do you? Would you care to jack into the terminal? Want me to jack what? All right, let's do this. This will be a live session, so events may take an unexpected turn. But don't quit if you feel uncomfortable. You could miss out on something truly remarkable. If you feel unready to handle what comes next, you can interrupt the session immediately. Now for your safe word. Samurai. And saved. Now bear with me a moment. 
scanning your personal profile. You should see compatible dolls in just a second. matches interesting is that normal or who can say what is normal you're clearly a unique person with unique tastes our system can handle it so who will it be angel or sky rather go with sky i couldn't have chosen better myself now for the payment and you'll venture into the clouds there you go. And the payments come through. The entire floor is open to you if you wish to wind down first. Sky awaits you in booth nine. All right. Disconnect, please. Is that it? <clears throat> we have a strict no weapons policy here at Clouds. Please deposit any and all hazardous items with me. Too bad they can't deposit these hands. Only two willing to spread their legs for you. Sad. Fuck you, Go Johnny. With dick, Johnny. We hope you enjoy your stay. Johnny's like, still no bitches, huh? Guess that makes you a real deviant. Would have had more choices if I didn't have a certain brain parasite. Yeah, Johnny, you dick. Eat a dick. That's funny. He's just like, eat a fucking dick, Johnny. Pro Manticore. Mix it up. Alright, I guess we just go in here. Hi, I'm Sky, and you must be Vincent. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Call me by my government name. V. Just V. Only people who know me real well can use my real name. Okay, then. V. Welp, looks like a this will be interesting. <laughs> Even I didn't know his name was so, Vincent. So what's that say? It's like I'm the player. I'm dying. literally playing the character. A <laughs> safe word immediately. <laughs> so V, your dog, samurai. I'm out later. <laughs> How do you know I'm dying. Deep inside, you fear this. Cower before it. So what if I do? Why do you care? Of all the voices in your head. The loudest is that calling for help. Look around. All of this is your doing. There's something in those mirrors. Way back. It's a projection. Your inner landscape. Just what I needed. Therapy with a robo-hooker. I'm not here to analyze you. That's not something I do. I'm here to fulfill your deepest, most hidden desire. Oh, shit. Looking for someone named Evelyn Parker. Used to work here. Know her? Know where she is? You need answers. That's clear. Just not the ones you think you need. I asked you a simple question. Evelyn Parker. Not the most important thing you're looking for, is she? I can smell your fear. You're afraid of something else. I was told this place to fulfill my deepest desires. Not what I was expecting, this. When true desires go unfulfilled, they turn into needs. We are here to reach for them and beyond. We are here to understand. So what is it I need so badly? To come to terms with the fact that you died. Now move on already. That's tough. Rather let it eat away at me a bit more. Fear of death is what drives us all. 
to do what we do. You're scared because you've given up on your dreams. What happened to becoming the best in all of Night City? Still want to be the best. Never gave up on that goal. Chances of getting there are starting to look pretty slim, though. I just want the world to know that I was here. That I mattered. Instead of a dream, you're living a nightmare. You're afraid of being erased, as if you never existed. Or is it just the fear of becoming someone else? Different? The people I've lost live on in my thoughts. And that's what I'll be. A memory. Or just an annoying little voice in someone else's head. You don't see death as destruction. The end. But as a change. That thought alone could save your life. I'm afraid of becoming someone else. Forgetting who I am. You're already becoming someone else. Every second of every day. Still, I feel... a connection between who I was and who I'm turning into. What you really fear... is becoming someone you don't recognize in the least. <sighs> so what now? You find out what it is you need to do. Which is... You're gonna tell me? You've never passed down from anything in your life. Even when you maybe should have. You go to the city, knowing a stray bullet could end you while hailing a cab. But that's never stopped you from taking action. Going where you need. And it won't stop you now. Hey, thanks for the sub, Simon. I really appreciate it. But how do I keep up with everything that's changing? You have been keeping up. You've made an impact. Not a single thing in this world isn't in the process of becoming something else. Likewise, you never look back. If you gotta kill, kill. If you gotta burn it all to the ground, then let it burn. Thanks, uh, for all this. Jeez, don't even feel like getting up. Few do, but everything has its end. Damn, you gotta burn it, burn it to the fucking ground. Samurai. Oh, what's going on? Goddamn thing threw me out. I need to talk to you. Talk? You pulled the emergency brake, ripped me out just to talk? What happened? I do something wrong? Evelyn Parker, what do you know about her? Not much. Everyone's got their own booths, their own problems, their own little bubbles. It's a fragile ecosystem. People like you barge in, violate it, try to rearrange. No. You're looking good. It'd be a shame to lose that. I'm gonna beat you if you don't tell me what I need to know. Some kind of nah, we'll just pay I need her. this info. Name your price. <laughs> Fuck you, your Eddies, and that girl of yours. I could get fired for doing something like this. I'll make it worth your while. All right, fine. Hand it over and get out before you land me in the shit. Anything out of the ordinary happen here lately? Fine. Heard a customer did a number on her. But that's all I know. 
That's it. Shit like that happens around here way more often than anybody would care to admit. You ought to ask Tom. Two of them were inseparable, gossiping for hours on end. Who's Tom? A doll, like the rest of us. What do you think, an XBD star? Where will I find him? VIP area, booth two, I think. Thanks, girly. Thanks. See? You turn out to be useful after all. Oh, dog, I'm taking it up with you, here, now. You got any idea who I am? Ozeki. Is there a problem? This conk don't understand that I've got a right to be in there. From what I can see, your VIP membership has been revoked. Say what now? Please stay calm, sir. Or we're gonna have to escort you outside. me alone. Do a little sneaky. Yeah, we don't do non-lethal takedowns around here. I do want to hide the body, though. Somewhere I can hide the body? Ah, uh, right there. I don't think the camera is facing in here. Cool. One thing I do have to do really quick though is use the restroom. I'll be right back. I should be okay. It's not a hostile area anymore. Yeah. Oh! What do you mean? Oh, they are looking for me. They are looking for me. Ugh. Shoot me! Don't I'm hurt me! You. Relax, you're not in trouble. Just want to talk for a little. Where's Evelyn? Need to talk to her urgently. It's important. Well, are you mad at her or something? No. Know where she is or not. Uh, she's not here. Tried calling her more than once. No answer. Heard she was chipping a new faceplate in a clinic in Osaka. No, no. Oslo. That was it. Osaka or Oslo? Which is it? Uh, Oslo. Yeah, yeah, definitely Oslo. Come on, Evelyn tell you personally she was going away? Um, no, just didn't show up for work. Wasn't picking up either, so I asked Woodman what was up. Told me she left, like I said. Woodman, who is he? Mr. Forrest, but we all call him Woodman. Never really known why. Okay. Mr. Forrest, then. Who is he? Um, he's kind of like our caretaker. Finds new talent, deals with ugly situations. Could it be Woodman finally shed some light on this shit show? Man can only dream. The skull sponges and these dolls. Ugh. That's what they should be replacing. 